totally stressed out. Give me five minutes. Just go for a walk. Alright, so in my living room now I have with me DJ Goals, who's a DJ by profession. He's got a zest for life, a passion for music, and we're going to find out lots more about him today. Welcome to the show, buddy. So how long have you been a DJ for? About 18 plus. So you've been a DJ for 18 years, and it's a fantastic profession in which you get to travel so much, uh, get to meet so many new people. Um, how stressful is it for you? Initially, it was a uh, trouble because the whole world used to up working and we used to go home only at like five o'clock and uh, that is what you know uh, i think we just got into it over mm -hmm. all these years so uh, when did you first start putting on weight um this is many years back i used to uh, do my gymming very very regularly and uh, because i come from a family where my dad was a wrestler and uh, he used to go to, he had his own akhara also must be very fit and things yeah he still is I mean, okay. I mean, when he walks with me it's like he's my brother Okay, so that's, been, that's what we been doing in school, and uh, after uh, when I I went and saw him what he was used to do, I mean there was not kind of thing I could not go into an akara and do this thing because there are all these wrestlers doing their bit. Being overweight, does it affect your morale? Does it affect your self confidence? It does, it does, it does. In a lot of places it does, but uh, uh, I'm I'm just you know I can just say that I'm just a little lucky to be in a kind of profession where it suits you, you know. Yeah. So that also, you know, let me all right if I'm looking all right, uh, you know, you're sitting on a uh, position where people are looking up to you, you know what I mean? So this is not really coming on to you like, you know, you're not mm -hmm. really looked down upon because of mm -hmm. weight. So, but this does not happen with everyone, you know, you don't, you're not, you don't get into that starlight ever. You know, talking about earlier when, when you weren't on this diet and weren't working out, what was your diet like? What all would you eat? Anything that works, man. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm a foodie. <laughs> okay. So I cook myself and mm -hmm. I, uh, I'm into hardcore. Uh, I'm a hardcore non-vegetarian. Mm -hmm. For me, it's like from breakfast to the late night snack or mm -hmm. whatever has to be something mm -hmm. non-vegetarian. Perfect, perfect. And then way to go, 17 and a half, 18 kgs is what you said you've yeah. lost. And that's uh, that's a big amount and we well, hope he loses. Six, seven months that it's taken. In me. six to seven months. Yeah. It's absolutely yeah. fantastic and hope. Well, there's uh, a lot, lot to go back. Well, then. you're on the right track at least. Yeah, and when yeah. uh, any last messages you want to tell other people out there who are probably uh, fighting the same battle you are right now? I would just say that uh, just don't think tomorrow because that tomorrow will never come and you've got to do it today. That was DJ Goals for you and he's, uh, he's on the warpath on the battlefront against weight and he's doing a great job at it. Thank you so much for being in the studio. Thank you.